Hey guys, it's Jade. <clears throat> it's been a little bit. I uh, haven't been feeling the best the past couple weeks or so. Energy's uh, really, really, really down. Uh, but I am feeling better now. So um, I wanted to do a haul of some things I had picked up uh, before I started feeling extra bad. Um, and also, somebody had requested that I do a B6 size laminated um, traveler's notebook. I just wanted to say that I did start on that. Um, and I, when I went to laminate it, it my laminator would not heat up. So it was broken. I was like, really? After three months, this is brand new. Um, so I contacted the brand they sent me a new one but I actually ended up buying a uh, one that was on clearance at office depot for $16.91 it's a swing line um, and when I looked it up online it had like five or six reviews and I got it because all the reviews that were on there actually was five stars so um, and I looked up the one that I had before the one that broke um, that stopped heating up and the reviews were very mixed a lot of people complaining that they used it once or like maybe four times and then it stopped working so I got this one um, and they actually scotch actually sent me a replacement one as well so now I have two laminators so I'll be using this one though um, and just have the scotch as a backup if something happens to this one so anyway guys i don't know if it's still on clearance but they, sh they should be um but it's a swing line inspire plus nine inch thermal laminator and like i said i got it off its depot for sixteen dollars and 91 cent um so that b6 will be a little bit longer in coming because, like I said, I'm just starting to feel better, and I just replaced my laminator. So, anywho, let's get started. So, you saw the laminator. Um, I found this at Big Lots. It is a totally adorable sticker book. It was $3, and actually, I went to Big Lots when it was twenty extra 20% 20 off, so it was less than that. And um, here are the different pages of stickers you get. And here, I just thought they were quick and cute. And, you know, with an extra 20% off, not a bad price, so... Uh, got that from Big Lots. Um, I did go to Tuesday morning a couple weeks ago. And the only thing I found that I wanted was these thickers. I don't know if you've seen them before. I'm trying to angle them right here. Anyway, they were $1.99. There's a SKU number. And here is what they look like really cute and they're front and back so let's see it's from let's see if it's from the good life collection by american crafts so that's all i got from tuesday morning recently i stopped by michael's i saw these online um and they're the adhesive pockets. So anybody looking for adhesive pockets know that it's not like a great deal where it's like 20 in a pack for three bucks like you can get at the Target dollar spot when um, they're in season. But um, they do have these, uh, it's like traveler accessory sticker pockets. I found this in the section where the traveler notebooks are um, that has like the little pockets and things like that. Um, so there's like three different kinds of adhesive pockets. Let's see, it might be more than that from the way the package looks. Let's pull them out and see. 
but I got two packs. They were $3.99 a piece, and of course I used coupons. I can't remember what coupons I used, so I don't even want to try and guess because it was, like I said, a few weeks ago, but I did not pay $3.99. So you got this um, adhesive secretarial pocket. That's cute. Um, you have this adhesive um like card pocket and you could probably find a way to split that down the middle and meld it back together and individualize the pockets if you need to and then they have these adhesive pockets so these come off and then this too just like a plain pocket so um that's actually not a bad deal i guess for what you get here and like i said it's a quick easy alternative for those who weren't able to find the um target dollar spot pockets this season again um i don't know if i have mentioned this in a previous one but my experience with the target dollar spot pockets is that they release them at the very beginning of the back to school uh craze frenzy they put them in the dollar spot and you got to get them then because if you don't get them they're gonna get bought up and they're not gonna have them again for the rest of the year um that's just been my experience in my area they come out with the back to school stuff i get them when i see them um, when I don't see them anymore, I know that they've pretty much been bought up and they're not, they usually do not release them again until it's time for back to school again. To me, I think that should be a staple at the dollar spot because people want them. And so they're going to sell. So I don't know why they just don't sell them year round, but you know, people do a lot of dumb stuff that we don't understand. So anywho. Lastly, I did stop by a Hobby Lobby. I found a lot of things on clearance. Um, but the first thing I did go there for was to get a one of these little paper pads. Um, I like the... Sorry, I didn't open the sides. I always forget. I need to do better with that. Um, anyway, it was when it was half off, so it's not... $8.99. I think guess it was what $4.50 or something. Um, because I wanted to do a project, those little uh journals that Lyric Lover um did in one of her craft videos for the, the season. Um, I do have a craft fair coming up, and I thought that would be a cute, fast, um, good idea. I will link the video I'm talking about below. Um, so yeah, I got uh, one of these paper packs and I think once they go on sale again, I might go get one or two more. We shall see, but I did get that one. Um, I also found, like I said, some things on clearance. I found these sticker, these alpha stickers on clearance. They had the silver, brown, and red. They had some other colors as well, but these were the ones I liked the best. Um, and they were all 59 cent a piece. I also found these um, pocket cards. They were $1.50 a piece. And I think these had come down some because they were like two something before when I've been in there. Um, but there are the designs if you can see that. I know it's kind of hard. And here are the, the designs on this one. And these are three by four pocket cards. And I found another one on clearance that was the double sided four by six inch pocket cards. And these were only 90 cent. And it's funny because I, I saw an exact same one, the exact same, the same size, same cards, everything. And they were like a dollar fifty or two bucks or something like that. And I just happened to be strolling in another area, and it was on an end cap. This one for ninety cent. And I thought maybe um, 
I, they were missing some and that's why it was but I just counted and it's all to all 24 in there so check your Hobby Lobbies if you're interested and that's what they look like and these are just uh, I think these and these are the same thing they're just these are bigger versions so um, also I found this boutique ribbon on clearance for 85 cent um, more designs that you could use to make the little pin loops because it's elastic um, so it was 85 cent originally $3.99 but you know I ain't about that $3.99 life so did pick that up I found these cute designer um, tags for a dollar twenty let's see does it say how many you get in here it says 20 pieces um for notebooks i like them because here are the different designs and they kind of look vintagey and very junk journal-y um so these will be good to add to uh junk journals and smash books and things of that nature um lastly from hobby lobby i did pick up some of these blank slate glass bottle charms uh, I told you there was another type of bottle charm I wanted to work on um, that goes with the supernatural theme, and I needed some longer ones. Um, and Hobby Lobby seems to be the only place to carry the size that I need. I've been looking online, everything, and I just cannot find, I couldn't find a size like this. So I finally bit the bullet is originally $14.99 but thankfully blank slate was on clearance not clearance half off um when I went that time to Hobby Lobby so it ended up being what let's see $7.50 or something I don't know guys I'm terrible at math in my head anyway half of $14.99 that's what it was so I got plenty and um Hopefully soon I can make these up into the little charms I want to make them into. And I'll show you guys my supernatural charms um, that I've been working on. So anyway, that is it for me, guys. Um, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the weekend and a wonderful week. And I will catch you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.